Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming with another episode of New Vegas. All right, when we left off, I had uh, not stopped here. <laughs> I was over at the, uh, no oh jeez, I was over at the Strip, came over here because of who I'm going to pick up next, but uh, yeah, <laughs> I was dealing with a couple things, meeting Ganon for the first time, who we're, we're going to be picking up in just a moment. But I need to deal with my uh, dehydration first. There we go. Perfect. And that puts me at 29. Oh, food's next. Oh, boy. Food is next on the itinerary. Um, what do I... I could do that, but I want to wait until I need it. Especially because it raises health for like a full fucking minute. It's very useful. Um, hmm. Let's do Iguana on a stick. There we go. That's good enough. Alright, now Arcade. Last I saw him was over here. There he is. What's up? Uh, I'm gonna be taking you with me. What's your opinion on the current situation? I think you're on the right track. Well, that's the good. only way to ensure relative safety and independence for the people of New Vegas is to prevent others from taking control of the region. Yep. That means no NCR, no Mr. House, and no Legion. Absolutely. All right, I'd like you to come with me. There's something about that robot that doesn't seem all right to me. I'm not saying we shouldn't take it with us. I'm just saying that if it were to fall into Lake Mead and be irreparably damaged, and if you threw an EMP grenade in after it, well, there are worse things happening in the world, right? Arcade. That's giving you the better healing perk. What's your problem with Eddie? It just seems a little twitchy. Some of these robots, you look at them the wrong way, don't screw in a vacuum too bright. Okay. The next thing you know, you're a pile of ash on the floor and someone's stepping out of a vertebrate to sweep your remains into a Nuka-Cola bottle. That, yeah, that sounds like my brand of hum humor, all right. How did I find a me <laughs> in this game? Arcade is essentially me. That sounds a little paranoid, Arcade. Does it? Does it? It's really? <laughs> Are you I'm trying? Not exactly a mercenary, but taking out scumbags of this magnitude wouldn't cause me to lose any sleep. That's probably true. All right, fair enough. And let's uh, get going, huh? Although I just remembered, I didn't give him any of my uh, sure. armor. This I meant to give him. Like a pack Brahmin, okay. Well, I wasn't planning on it. To be fair, well, at least not right now. Um. <laughs> Courier Duster, I could give him that, though it won't give him any benefits. But what I could give him is that and that. Uh, can I make him equip it is a question. I don't think I can do it from this menu. So that's fine, I guess. Uh, Lucky, uh, it's still pretty good. I mean, he's carrying a Plasma Defender on him, and that's pretty good in and of itself. But it runs on uh, companion ammo, so it doesn't have all the benefits that a plasma defender would have otherwise so i mean yeah it's decent i guess also it turns out um what he had said was there's nothing new under the sun in latin uh i don't know why i didn't know that <laughs> uh maybe just because i was just so shocked at oh my god it's a me <laughs> that i didn't think of it right off hand anyway now that i've given him all of that oh he didn't equip Lucky. He prefers a Plasma Defender over it. Sure. Really? Just don't treat me like a pack Brahmin, okay? You... Really? Okay. That's different. Okay. Fine. Alright. We'll, uh, we'll run with it. That's fine. I'm just surprised is all. Okay. Well. In that case, let's get moving. I was I was actually honestly surprised I was able to carry all that to him. <laughs> all right. Now that we've gotten that all taken care of and we've learned he has a bit of a uh, thing against Eddie um here for whatever reason. Um Eventually, I want to get that uh, explosives up, because I'm pretty sure that means he can make grenades for me. 
even though I don't use grenades, that would be good to have in the back pocket. So, I mean, yeah, I eventually want that. But, that was a noise. <laughs> eventually, it's not right now, so we're good on that. Also, I, uh, these kids that usually chase a rat, I killed that rat on the way here. And, uh, of course they ate it, which is what they are want to do. Because that was why they were running after it in the first place. It can be found at Mick and Ralph. Well, that's good, but that's not where I'm going right now. Okay, now that I've done all of that, picked up uh, Arcade here. Where are you going? There you go. Now I know why he likes the, uh, why he likes that over Lucky. You were, you were chasing after this woman. Hello there. No, woman. No, not woman. It looked like it from an angle. <laughs> Sorry, sir. I apologize. Uh, this thug was just chasing after that civilian. The fuck? Good on you, Arcade. Good on you for being quick on the draw like that. Yeah, you're... Yeah. <laughs> I don't know how I did that mistake. The hairstyle. The hairstyle is what threw me, I think. A little bit. Okay. Um, well, if you're not going to sure. use it... Just don't treat me like a pack Brahmin, okay? I wasn't planning on it. Again, but, I mean... You know. Things happen. Um, should I give him some stim packs? I mean, they weigh nothing. Sure, why not? Fuck it. He'd probably use them. Or need them. Uh... Sure, there we go. Stack him up with 40. That'll work. That'll be just fine. Those kids are still chasing each other around with that fake gun, I think. At least I don't think... No, he's not doing that anymore. That's weird. I don't remember taking the gun from him. At least not off the top of my head. Anyway, um... Let's, uh... See what else we got. Yeah, I'm pretty sure if I dress in anything, uh overtly Kaiser E. He's not going to be happy, so I'm not going to do that. <laughs> sheriff's hat. I don't remember picking up the sheriff's hat. Hmm. Ah, well. Um. Where was I going next? I honestly don't remember. Oh, boy. Did I not do that? I didn't do that. Oh, shit. Oopsie doodle. That was the thing I was going to do. Oh, hey, buddy. Hey, you're the one who's been going around helping people around here, right? Yeah, me and Arcade the says a little to bit. Keep up the good work. He said to give you this. Well, thank you. Banana yucca fruit. Thank you. That's very useful. Very helpful. Again, sorry for mistaken identity earlier, sir. <laughs> Why am I doing this? This is a video game. <laughs> It's not like they can really hear me. Alright, anywho. Onward we go. Towards... Well, if fuck it can be bought, it can be found at Mick and Ralph. Yep. Yeah, gonna head over to the Kings and deal with that. And that's really all that's on my itinerary right now. My biggest thing was picking up Arcade. After that, my brain just blanked. Because <laughs> he's so cool. How have I never played with Arcade? How? How did I miss him all these years? <laughs> this game's been out for like half a decade. Alright, let's uh, go talk to... Uh, let's go talk to the king. He's apparently right over here. Hey, member. Oh, you're Pacer. I could kill you, or I could talk to the king. I'm just gonna talk to the king. Things have been a lot better since you helped with those soldier boys. Thanks again. So, what can I do for you? Sounds good to me. All right, let's uh, let's talk a little bit about the violence against the NCR citizens. I need you to stop that. Why Whoa, am I talking like that's that? That's a doozy. <laughs> Truth be told, I don't even know if I can pull something like that off. Uh, all I'm asking is that you try, because the kings will follow your leadership. Damn straight they will. It's some of the other locals that I'm worried about. That's true. On second thought, if I can whip this band of hooligans into obedience, a straight tough guy or two shouldn't be a problem. 
Did okay, you just call you your guys it. hooligans? No violence against the NCR on my watch. <laughs> but this makes us even, you hear? Fair enough, that makes us even. That's all I needed. Perfect. Now we return to Ambassador Crocker with the news that the King has agreed to cease hostility. Hostilities, rather. Word is those tough guy rangers are here. I ain't seen them myself, but how scary can they be? That's uh that's very indicative of why you haven't seen him. Where the hell is Rex going? Also, why is the world loading in like that? Rex, where the fuck are you going? Rex, what the hell? Um... Um... Is that a normal bug? Have I just stumbled on something weird that is not documented? Because it feels like it. Rex! What are you doing? What are you doing? Are you... Are you going into the Lucky 38? You're going into the Lucky 38. Good riddance, Caesar. We can finally enjoy some R&R &R without Strips worrying about a place. legion attack on McCarran. And people. I'll never understand the allure of giving away your money to the rich. Yeah, that's, that's a good point. I don't understand that either, to be perfectly fair. Although, to be fair, if you put it that way, you don't know why you give your money to the government because they're rich. Uh, queer, air quotes when I say that. Because just because some people in the government are rich does not mean that the government itself is rich. So, I mean, yeah, I don't know where the fuck I was going with that uh, thought process. To be quite frank with you. I think Rex just uh, was supposed to be in the Lucky 38, if I remember right. He was supposed to be in there. And then uh, once he uh, realized that he was over there and I was in the building with uh, the king, he was like, oh shit, I need to go back to the Lucky 38 run. <laughs> okay, and that might have been it. I don't know. I don't know. Honestly, I don't know. I am just figuring from this point on what could have been the case. What I like is that some of the... Uh, roads on this side aside from like the main entrance these roads are torn up but the main entrances road are just relatively fine it's relatively good i find that funny i don't know why anywho now that we're all the way over here with our caden toe might as well talk to them and tell them that the ncr is uh, a little dealt with just to uh, make them think that we're on the same side when we're not. Okay. Morning. Morning. And I'll still need to deal with uh, the, the boomers. Not the boomers. I've dealt with the boomers. The uh, Brotherhood. That's That knew it started with a B. <laughs> the Brotherhood and the uh, White Gloves. I'll need to deal with them. But uh, that'll be in another time. Let's talk to Crocker. Ah, hello. Hi there. I trust you have something to report concerning the Freeside situation? Yeah. Uh, want to play a hand of caravan? I wanted to talk about yes. that. Do you have something to report? Yeah. I spoke to the king and he promised to stop the violence against NCR citizens, which is apparently what hear. I should have kept that He's favor for. He's got a lot for. of sway in Freeside, so we can expect a dramatic drop in violence soon. That's good. Now, you're probably wondering about your reward. This has been something of a hot-button topic, so was able to secure this for you. Really? What did you secure? I mean, I got some fame. 600 bottle caps. I see. I risked my neck out there. Couldn't you spare a little more? Well, I don't officially have access to any more funds, but here. This is from me personally. There's more coming your way, too. There's more I coming my way. I received a message up at Hoover Dam. She's been Hello? following your exploits and has requested that you meet with her. Ooh, a I'm not officially in the employ of the NCR, so there's nothing forcing you to go. But I'd go see her sooner rather than later. Fair enough. The Colonel is not someone you want to keep waiting. So, Colonel 
Big Wig for the Republic Part 2. But I don't want to do for the Republic. I want to do for Yes Man. Okay, at Hoover Dam. I, uh... I don't want to do that, honestly. I want to keep working with Yes Man. I want to make this, uh... good place for the people who live here, not for the NCR. Although, the NCR would help make it a better place for the people here. At the same time, a lot of these people will be a little annoyed that a government just... Whoa! Whoa! Okay, okay. <laughs> just phase into me, why don't you? Wow, that threw... That threw off my uh, train of thought. <laughs> a lot of these people will be annoyed that a government that didn't represent them... Uh, in the first place, that isn't one of their own, just waltz in and said they're taking control of the place. They'll probably be a little, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? I don't know what the word I'm looking for is. I'm a, still a little sleepy, guys, and I had some shit to deal with this morning. A lot of the adrenaline of my, uh, sink, <laughs> the sink popping a pressure leak... A lot of the adrenaline from that situation has uh, worn off, so now I'm trying to drink coffee to bring myself back to normal. But yeah, uh, the, the word I'm probably looking for is uh, aggravated. That this group of people, this government, just takes control of the entire region while they didn't have a say in it. Which I would understand, honestly. It's a bit like colonizing a uh, area, much like, you know, <laughs> the British and all of the other major European countries did, and saying that they're going to be a part of this whether they like it or not. And then America did the same thing um, when they became a country, as is, you know, what major superpowers or attempted major superpowers are wont to do. They exert their will on things that do not necessarily want it. Now, Kaisar would do it just out of strength and kill anyone who disagrees. The NCR is more of a, a little bit like America. Tries to make it sound and look like you wanted this. Because look at all the benefits you're getting from it. Look at all of these things that you're now able to do. Ugh. It's one of those sort of things, you know? Maybe. Now, I'm, I'm, I'm pulling stuff out my ass <laughs> as I continue to talk. Who the... What happened to Little Buster? Cram opener. What happened to Little Buster? I don't see any enemies back here. What the hell happened? That's a unique weapon. I can tell that much. But what the hell happened? Um. Uh. Um, I'm gonna, <laughs> don't judge me, don't judge me for this, but considering I don't know what to do regarding him, uh, considering I'm pretty sure that this is probably a bug, I'm just going to make the best of the situation <laughs> and put him where bodies belong. <laughs> Oh, can I shut the lid? No? Shit. Okay, well, that would have been great if I could. I'm a horrible person. That's what I am. I'm a horrible person. But I... What? What happened to him is what I want to know. There's nothing here that suggests what could have happened. He just came over here and it looks like he just dropped dead. That's what it looks like. But what... 
And it wasn't that one guy. It wasn't that one guy who, like, was cheating people. Oh, hey, it's another King's member. It wasn't, like, cheating people hey, by the one who's been going faking heroism. Around here, right? The King says to keep up the good work. He said to give you this. Oh, did it? Well, thank you. Thank you for the stem pack. It wasn't that one guy, because his name was Orin, I thought. Wasn't it? So, Little Buster was the uh, guy who was in the NCR base, you know, doing bounties the same as I was. Or at least he was trying to get out of the... <clears throat> he was trying to get out of the bounty game. I was getting just into it. And then he just went over there and died. I don't understand. I, I'm kind of curious now. I kind of want to find out. But there's not many ways to find out. I don't know. Now, at this point, I'm just running around because I don't know what else to do. I should probably deal with the white gloves. Next episode, I'll do that. But right now, I kind of want to figure out what happened to Little Buster. Also, now that I think about it, is Orin still over where I think he was? He was over there. He was over there not that long ago, that entrance. So is he over here now? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, doesn't look like he's over here. That's a King's member and the two other people. No Orin. Hey, you're Whoa, the what the going around helping what people the around here, fuck? right? The King says to keep up the good work. He said to give you this. Okay, that's the third one in this episode, but what the fuck happened there? What the... He just ran by. He just ran by and then it zoomed in at some random speck on the wall over here. What the hell? <laughs> okay. I guess. Dafook. I don't know what to think of that. Right, anyway, um. Kids, you should not be running down this little alleyway. You should not be running down this little alleyway. I had a confrontation over here. I wonder if the bodies are still here. No, no, they're not. Wait! The local is. The one local guy is. That's not good. But I guess these kids have gotten used to seeing dead bodies. In this little uh, hellhole. But yeah, um... I want to figure out what happened there. I want to figure out what happened to Orin. I might look all of that up. And tell you next episode. And, uh, yeah, that was a, uh, that was a bit of a thing. Also, I want to figure out why he prefers the plasma defender over the, uh, revolver I just gave him. Because if I remember correctly, the revolver is pretty damn good stats. I mean, I'm not entirely sure if it measures up to a plasma defender and I gave him the ammo sure. for it. Just don't treat me like a pack Brahmin, okay? So, I don't know, honestly. I don't know. If I try it again, maybe it'll... No, he still prefers the Plasma Defender over it. Okay, that's weird. There's a whole bunch of shit I need to figure out. There's a whole bunch of things I need to look up, because right now I don't know shit. <laughs> anyway... I'm going to end the episode here for right now. This episode's just been nothing but a confused mess from start to finish. And I apologize. <laughs> I've just been running around freeside like I'm a fucking crazy person. Oh, Jesus. Which I am. I'm going to end the episode. Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. Click the like button if you like this particular video. And share in comments. We can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one and only Stray Cat. Playing games and being a confused fucking mess because of how today started and getting Ganon. 
and I'm just <laughs> for you. That was the weirdest outro yet. A lot of it's my fault. I'm just confused as all fuck as to what happened everywhere. Little Buster's dead. I fucking met a ghost. Fucking King's member as well as like two others. And Ganon is just refusing to use Lucky. The fuck? The fuck is my life? What the fuck is my life right now? Well, at least we look cool. Kind of. Him more than me. <laughs>